Now to one of the NFL's most controversial players taking the field overnight in the midst of sexual assault allegations. ABC's Zachary Keish has more. Playing on a $230 million guaranteed deal, the quarterback debuted with the Cleveland Browns last night. Watson's rolling out, finds a target, overshoots. Two dozen women who were allegedly hired by Watson as massage therapists accused the quarterback of lewd sexual behavior. He has vehemently denied any non-consensual contact with any of his accusers. Prior to Friday's game, Watson and the team released this message. I'm truly sorry to all the women that I've impacted in this situation. Um, my des decisions that I made in my life that put me in this position, um, you know, I, I would definitely like to have back. Two grand juries declined to charge him, and by June, Watson had settled 23 of the 24 suits against him. But the NFL determined he violated the league's personal conduct policy. On August 1st, Judge Sue L. Robinson, the NFL's disciplinary officer, handed Watson a six-game suspension. Discipline can be appealed, which the league did at the direction of Commissioner Roger Goodell. There was uh, multiple violations here, and they were egregious, and it was predatory behavior. The NFL wants Watson's suspension extended to 17 games, the full season. All right, Zachary, thank you so much. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.